everyone. My name is China, and I am coming to you from my channel, That Girl China, with a Monday morning Dollar Tree haul. I found a lot of cool stuff, excited to show them to you. Um, let me forewarn you though, I had two 12 ounce glasses or cups of coffee, so I'm like very wired which um, can either go really well, I'll be bubbly the whole video, or it can go terribly bad, I will be like stuttering, not making sense, um, and maybe talking too fast. So with that being said, consider yourself forewarned, and let's jump right into this haul. I got a lot of cute stuff, can't wait to show you guys. All right, first things first, I have looked at this photo frame many, many, many times, and I don't know why, um, but I keep passing it up. Now, it does come in an 8x10. I have it here in a 5x7. But there's just something about this little baby that, I don't know, is just so appealing to me. I think he's very adorable. And I just want to, like, snatch him up. Now, I hope that doesn't sound like, you know, like, predator-like or... Um, like kidnapper like I just think he's so cute and it reminds me of when my sons were little now do not be mistaken I do not want babies my sons are adults and I'm done with that phase of my life but it's just something about him that drew me to this frame but of course I do like the wood grain in the um in the frame and the gold trim I think this is a beautiful frame I think it would be coupled um really well with the 8x10 and I think it goes with all different types of decor so again I know there's a lot of glare guys so I apologize but look at him he is so cute and his little I don't know I kind of like a little mohawk style here I think he's so adorable and you've got that wood grain here it's a light light wood grain and then the gold trim I think this is super cool um, very on trend again would go with a lot of decor and so I bought it and I'm going to go back, I'm going to buy the 8x10 today. Um, but again, if you see it, super pretty, highly recommended. And it does have a kickstand, so if you want to stand it up. And it also comes with little hooks, so you can hang it up long ways, or you can hang it up horizontally if you prefer. Either way, this little baby's a cutie. I don't know who he is, but he is adorable. All right, some more items that I picked up. Now, this is going to be out of the makeup aisle, so of course... You know, us ladies got to be fierce with our lashes, and Dollar Tree is the place to go if you're not wanting to spend a lot of money on lashes. They're very compatible. Com compatible? Compatible? No, it's this is not violence here. Let's. They're compatible with um, lashes that you would purchase, you know, elsewhere for more money. Um, I think there's a company called. I, why? Why did I go there? Because I, I have no idea what the company's called. Um, it starts with an S, nonetheless. But anyway, um, very nice lashes. This is a set that I normally get. It's called Demure. Um, they're not Demure because they're actually pretty dramatic. Um, and at a dollar, y'all, a dollar. This brand I do like. Um, Sassy and Chic also sell some. I'm not really big on those, but they carry these and the Ioni lashes. The Ioni lashes are layered. They're really, really nice. The quality is definitely there. But these are my second favorite, which are LA Colors. And they do not come with the glue, but they sell Kiss brand glue. And they do sell LA Colors brand glue at the Dollar Tree. So let me hold this sucker still so you can see it. I've shown these many times, and they come in a lot of different styles. They have some that are more, um, what's the word? Um, more work appropriate, and then there's some that you know, you're you're going to get it popping like at the club on Saturday. So, and there's like in between as well. So definitely check out the Dollar Tree. These are the sets that I get. And this is actually the set that I'm wearing right now. And I think they're super cute and like a steal, a steal at a dollar. Okay, another item that I found is, um, this is also by LA Colors, is this Sugar Lip Scrub. Um, and it smooths and softens lips gently exfoliates um and it comes in this little package here and it says that it's new so it says gently rub across lips remove excess with tissue and it's to exfoliate so it includes vitamin e um, natural sugar and coconut oil 
and I just think this is a must have, especially for this time of the year where, you know, it's really cold, the air is getting drier, and you definitely don't want to be walking around with some crusty lips. That is not a cute look. Um, so, you know, I'm just going to, you know, keep it 100. I've seen some, some people, I've seen some folks out there with some dry, some dry, crusty lips. I'm here to help you out. Look, I'm, I'm here for you. I'm here to help you. Um, I either get you some Vaseline, some Carmax, but before you do that, you need to exfoliate, get that dead, dry, flaky lip skin off and and get you this at a dollar great phenomenal deal this is a great name brand um i love i so far i have no complaints against their product they're like on point and for a dollar you can't beat it y'all okay so here's another one now this is wet and wild another brand um that is carried like at um your pharmacies what is it Dwayne reed walgreens um walmart's targets um, and this is going to be a cover all press powder, wet and wild. And it says that it's a light medium. Now they did have multiple shades. I'm hoping this is my shade. Um, it's hard to, you know, when you're in a store and you're not really able to get a good look at the product, it's hard to tell whether it's going to be an exact match. But what I can do is always blend it with other products that I have to, till I get the right shade. Um, that's mine. Okay, so it says all day wear, radiant, weightless finish, Visibrite, trademarked, whatever this is. This is something to do with their brand. Complex reduces the appearance of wrinkles and rejuvenates skin. And I'm all about reducing the look or the appearance of wrinkles. So I don't know about y'all. If y'all want a smoother complex complexion, um, you want to try to hide the wrinkles. Um, you definitely want to pick this product up uh, again, wet and wild, a name brand. I have not tested it, but I've heard good reviews on this uh, product, um, through other YouTubers who have already shown it and featured it in their haul. So again, light medium is going to be this color. And, um, again, they had it in multiple shades and you are getting 0.26 ounces of pressed powder. Okay. Enough about that. We've got now, again, cover all. This is wet and wild, and this is a cover stick or a corrector. Um, so basically concealer, and this, again, is in light medium, so the same shade. And I went ahead and picked this up as well because, you know, we want an even complexion, um, and you want to cover up, you know, maybe dark spots, under eye circles, um, acne scarring, stuff of that sort, um, or maybe even, like, you know, uh, sun damage stuff like that so again cover all wet and wild a name brand and a phenomenal deal at a dollar so basically i have the powder we've got our concealer and and i picked up the wet and wild cover all cream foundation so in this situation you're getting one fluid ounce it says all day wear medium to full coverage lightweight satin matte finish i love a matte finish I prefer matte finish actually. And um, again, this is something that they've trademarked. Visibrite Complex reduces the appearance of wrinkles and rejuvenates skin. So here's the product right here. And let me see if we can get the camera to focus for us. This is what it looks like. And so again, an ounce of your um, foundation, you've got your pressed powder, and you've got your concealer. All of these, each a dollar. Great deal and a name brand. So definitely be on the lookout at your Dollar Trees. I've seen other haulers. They have shown this product as well. So I'm pretty sure your store should be getting them too. All right, so that's all in terms of makeup itself. But I also picked up this LED makeup mirror by Sassy and Chic. Um, it's an LED light, great for your purse or travel bag. It requires two AAA batteries that are not included. So I'm going to try to show where, you know, you won't get reflection from the, um, the mirror. It comes in white and pink. So I picked up it in pink. The other one had like a white trim here. I'm going to try plugging it in so you guys can see it. Let's see if it, if it works. Um, I should have opened this up ahead of time, but I wanted you to see the packaging. So that's the packaging. And I found it in the aisle where um, the makeup was at. Okay, so hopefully you don't have to unscrew anything. 
Oh Lord, this is too complicated. If I break a nail, we're gonna have a problem. Okay, no, all right, so this is the back. Just opened it up and I happen to have a pack of batteries. Let's see if I can open it without breaking my nails because that would be tragic, right? It would be tragic. Uh, I don't want to be walking around with a broke down nail. So y'all, why, why, why do they make this so hard to open? It's like, not only is it kid proof, it's adult proof. Um, I need some scissors. Okay, maybe this is taking too long and we're gonna have to maybe pause the video so I can, okay y'all, I'm gonna pause the video so you're not seeing me struggling here with um, a pack of batteries. I will be right back. All right guys, sorry about those earlier shenanigans. I am back and I have put in the um, batteries and so this is what it's looking like. I'm gonna face it this way because what I'm trying to do is avoid like, well, let's see what happens. I'm just curious what'll happen if we flash it. Oh, you could see me in the camera. Isn't that cool? It's like this whole other world. It's a whole other dimension. Um, okay, so it it is not that bright. So it's not as bright as this ring light that I have here, but it does, you know, it lights up. And the good news is you are able to get a good look at yourself but it's not that scary mirror that shows like every friggin' pore on your face. Um, I don't know if you guys are familiar with those magnified mirrors. I think they are horrific. Um, they make you like want to walk around with like a, a black veil or with a potato sack over your head. Um, or run to the doctor and get like chemical peels and Botox injections and Juvederm. I've had those mirrors and I have to stay away from them. I, they're banned from the house. We cannot have them. Um, but anyway, I would recommend this. Um, it is uh, great for travel. It does light up as you can see. There's some lighting there. Um, not super bright, um, but hey, at a dollar, also a great stocking stuffer. So if you know someone, maybe he does a lot of traveling. Um, I like to put my makeup on here. Um, you know, I'm not in front of a vanity or anything. I do it here at my desk and I hand hold a mirror. So that might be uh, good for someone that would be into that. Now the, um, what you see here is there's a little button in the back and that's how you turn it off. So this is what it looks like. It comes in this pink color and also comes in white and that is enough about that mirror. Okay, so let's keep it moving guys because I have a lot to cover. Okay, these I found and I've actually, again, this is something that I've seen like numerous times, but I keep passing it up. Um, these are great thermal socks, especially if you're someone that maybe you go like skiing every year. I know there's um, certain kind of socks that you need to wear that um, are anti-moisture, uh, but these are great for layering. Um, they're so cozy and they feel like they would really keep your feet warm. These are for men. They're coming in sizes 6 to 12. But what I saw when I set eyes on these socks were sock monkeys. So if you are very crafty and you like those super adorable sock monkeys and you can make them, y'all, run and go buy you some of these socks. Do these not look like sock monkeys? I have a little sock monkey. He's on top of the closet right now. But anyway, um, I you can make them into like little ornaments. Um, I'm sorry, this thing is letting off a lot of lint. You probably see it flying around because of the very high lighting here. Um, let's see if we can adjust that, can't we? Mm. Anyway, um, sock monkeys. So, or gifts for men, cozy socks to keep them warm. If you, you have a man in your life, your brother, your dad, your grandfather, your, your man, your man, he's out there working in the cold and you want to keep him warm, get him some thermal socks or make some sock monkeys. Um, super cute and um, they are available. I've seen them multiple, multiple times. Never picked them up until I thought of the sock monkey idea. All right, so other items that I picked up, socking stuffers, y'all, how many days are we down to? I think today's the 14th. I have no idea, I don't keep up with the days anymore. It's just what, it's, it's whatevs, okay? Um, so this one is these little boxes of chocolate. It's by the brand Elmer Chocolate, and you are getting, Let's see, I don't know, four. Four different types. So it has caramel, strawberry cream, orange cream, and cocoa truffle. Um, and so you get a box of four chocolates, and I liked it because of the packaging. They do have bags and little wrapping boxes and stuff that match this print, but again, a really cute stocking stuffer. So I picked it up in this variety, which says Merry and Bright. 
very cute font there. Also picked it up. Merry Christmas with a truck. Now, I don't know about you guys personally, but I'm kind of like over did I am I saying this out loud? I'm kind of over the whole truck thing. I'm I it's it's kind of like everywhere, but I know there's a lot of people that like it. And so that's why I picked this up because I know there's people that love this red truck. I I think they've been doing it for like more than a year now and I'm kind of like okay I'm done with the truck but for those of you who are not who love the truck I get it because I'm into gnomes and gnomes have been around for a while and I'm sure there's people that are like over the gnome thing too um but you know teach his own we all have our likes our own personalities you've got this merry christmas beautiful red truck with of course your little pine tree back here and it is the exact same chocolate great stock and stuff for Last one that I found, which is my favorite, is this very vintage looking uh, Santa Claus. And it says Believe. And then you got the little trees down here. And I just love, I love the whole vintage look. I love that wood paneling in the background. I think it is so beautiful. And again, a great stocking stuffer. If you're building gift baskets, which is something that I like to do, these would look so beautiful in a gift basket. And again, there's three varieties. There may be more. These are the only ones that I saw. So be on the lookout, guys. Be on the lookout. Um, I have gone to the store many times, hadn't seen them. I just saw them in my uh, trip this past week. Okay, moving right along, some more items. Um, now, this is going to be for storage purposes. And I picked this up because it is extremely rare that I have come across you guys might have had a different experience, but it, I, it's extremely rare that I've come across a very hot pink or a fuchsia pink, um, what is it called, like storage container. Um, and when I saw these, I'm like, wow, these are these are unusual. At least to me, they are. So I found these plastic, they're an acrylic style storage. It says slotted basket. And so this is going to be long ways um, or a rectangular shape. I think these would work so great in desk drawers as well as kitchen drawers, bathroom drawers. There's so many areas you could put this in. Um, I thought it was so cute and in this bright pink, um, not the average color that I've seen at Dollar Tree. Um, here and there, they'll pull out pink, but I've never seen something like this in this color. So I went ahead and picked up three. I think these would work really well. Um, if you have an artist, you know, their colored pencils, their brushes, um, uh, what is that? Pastels, paints, um, or if, you know, ha hair care products. You do hair care products. You can do your your um, teeth or dental care. Um, there's just so many different things to do that. If you want to use it in the bathroom, you can also use it in the kitchen. Um, so, again, for storage, would look really great in a girl's room, a teenager's room, if you want to get organized. And, of course, New Year's, a lot of resolutions are... I'm going to get myself organized and there's no better way than to head to the Dollar Tree and go pick up storage containers. Okay, so I also found this one, which to me is still in that same family of pink. This one is being called a basket. So it's just a basket. Here it is in comparison to these. Okay, um, so this is the size of that one. Hopefully you can gauge that. I'm going to put my hand to kind of give you an idea of what the size is. And again with that pink and so many different storage ideas. And now's the time to start preparing, start stacking up on storage containers um, to get yourself organized. This one is like a tray, um, great for forms. There's again, so many things that you can do with this. And this one is also just named a basket. And it's got that weaving detail. And if you wanna compare it in size, here's gonna be the smaller one. And then you have these. So I bought all these as a little set here. Um, I don't have a lot of pink, um, but I'm going to find somebody to give it to who is a big fan of the pink color. Okay, let me put the video on pause real quick. I will be right back. I've got some more items to show you, and I want to make sure this video doesn't run too long. Okay, guys, I'm back. Okay, so now we're going to jump into some toys here. Now, last, um, one of the last videos that I showed, um, I showed this little doctor kit, and what they're calling it is a medical kid playset. So, you know, again, with this, the, um, 
what is this called stethoscope and you have some tweezers here a syringe so different little a thermometer different little items um, for playing if you know you want to pretend doctor nurse um, but I also found these that are kind of part of the same family this is a dentist kit I don't know I found this one really cute so you have these two um, and I just thought this was so cute so in this one you're getting um, one tooth mold one plate one toothbrush, one tweezer, and one scissors. Um, I just thought this was so adorable. Um, and I think also, you know, getting kids more comfortable with, you know, maybe visiting the dentist. Because um, I don't know about y'all, like, I've had to go to the dentist many times, you know, teeth cleaning, whitening. Um, I had a root canal done, which is like horrific. Um, having wisdom teeth pulled. Um, but, you know, this is very important, you know, to take care of your teeth. And what better way, you know, to get kids encouraged uh, by giving them a little play set if they just want to play pretend and you want to get them off the TV, off the gaming systems, off the laptops, and actually playing with toys again, you know, you definitely want to pick these up. And at a dollar, they're a great deal and they're small enough to stuff into a stocking. Okay, another item that I picked up was this little dinosaur. It says that it's a space robot okay so let me adjust his little legs here and this is going to be a t-rex so this is what he looks like here's my hand for comparison so he's roughly about the size of my hand and he's supposed to make noise so okay here you go and his eyes light up guys and i think this was made for a cute little toy i did do a dinosaur gift set which i will link down below are you good okay which I will link down below if you guys want to like recreate a little gift basket with um, dinosaurs. Okay, so I picked that up. Um, another item that I picked up, which also makes noise, is going to be this robot dog. So it's being called a space robot dog. I got it in this. I got it in this two hues of blue, but they also had it in black and white. Um, they got the little thing to pull out right here. And so let's pull that sucker out to make sure the battery isn't drained. And this is what he does. And he is lighting up. I don't know if you can see that. Can you see that? He lights up. I don't know whether or not it's showing up on camera, but he does. And so that's what this does. Okay, so again, a dollar. Um, this one is in case you are wanting to drive the parents of the child you're gifting this to crazy. Um, it, this is cute, but the noise that it makes is kind of like, oh my God. They also have this in another color. I want to say it was gray or blue. I picked it up in this lime green with the orange and it is a space UFO. Okay. So let's pull out the little tab down here and, uh, let's do the noise. So it's got a little button here. This is very Alfred Hitchcock to me. I don't, or what is that show called? It reminds me of that show from the 50s, The Twilight Zone. I don't know. I think they have an episode that involves like a spacecraft and it was a really big thing. In case you couldn't get enough of that noise, I'm doing it again. And this thing is lighting up. Okay, again, a dollar. Drive yourself crazy if you want to. Okay, another thing that I picked up is Overwatch. And these are Hot Wheels Overwatch. And they're based on the characters from that game. So I have this one, which is... Tracer, you got this little car here. So that's Tracer. They had several, several to choose from. I do not know the name of the characters. I know one of my sons play used to play um, Overwatch, and this is Reinhardt, and this is the vehicle that they come with. Um, again, there was more characters and, and um, Hot, you know Hot Wheels being a name brand. These are the ones that you can collect here in the back. Again, really good stocking stuffers. Also pick this one up. I like this because it's a, like a little set and it's a fire station set. And you know, a lot of little boys or little girls, girls um, you know, dream of becoming a fireman or a firewoman. And so I thought this was a little cute toy. So you get that little truck here. Um, here they have like a road closure sign. There's an arrow to redirect traffic. I don't know if you can see it. And then you have the little fire station. I thought this was cute. I don't know if the doors open up. They look like they do. The doors look like they open up. And it says it is die cast metal and plastic combined. So again, a cute little set. 
great for a stocking and a good deal at a dollar. Another item that I picked up, now this was really neat. And this is something that can involve, you know, mom or dad. And they had two different types that I saw, which are gonna be an airplane, uh, build your own airplane or build your own car. I did not pick up the car. It was a car or a truck, um, but I did pick up the airplane. Um, so this is what it looks like. You are getting 17, no, I'm sorry, that's a lie. You're getting 13 pieces. It's one kit and, uh, oh no, it says 14 pieces. All right, apparently I can't add. So 14 pieces here. It's build your own airplane and this is a finished product. And these are the tools that it comes with. And that's what it looks like in the back. I think this would be a lot of fun to put together with um, your, you know, your son or your daughter or with your granddaughter, or grandson, niece, nephew, uh, fill in the blank here. Um, and again, they have a vehicle, a different type of vehicle, either a car or a truck, really cute and a great deal at a dollar. All right, now to some girl stuff or what I call girl stuff, because when I was a girl and I think a lot of girls are obsessed with horses. So they have a collection of horses, different colors. They also had a gray one um, with black spots, which I did not pick up. So here's a brown one and it comes with its own little comb and you've got your hair that you can comb here and the hair that you can comb back here. And this is what the horse looks like if you wanna get an up close look. And it just says that it's a horse with a brush, ages three and up. So you have this one. Um, and then you have this one, which reminds me of a horse that my grandfather's brother had by the name of Jet. And Jet looked just like this horse. We never got to ride Jet. Um, we only got to admire him from afar because apparently he was pretty fast, hence the name Jet. But you know, girls love horses. Um, you know, that's why you have My Little Pony and, and a lot of unicorn stuff. Um, I was the stereotypical girl that loved horses also, um, but I also like Godzilla. So, you know, I'm just throwing that out there. Okay, so another item that I picked up, which I've passed up many times, but again, as a girl that used to love unicorns and Pegasus and horses, you know, these are so cute. Here you have Pegasus with this beautiful purple, it's like a lavender color, um, and the wings um, do move. So, you know, if you wanna do um, play, you know, let, let, Let's see how flexible, I'm trying to show you how flexible these wings are. Look at that, how beautiful that is, um, a Pegasus. And then I also have a unicorn here. So you can get a unicorn, there you are, or you can get a Pegasus, or you can get both. So um, great gift for little girls. Okay, so I'm gonna put another quick pause, we're gonna move some more stuff, and we are almost done, guys. Okay, guys, I'm back. All right, so I picked up a 48 piece um, puzzle and this one comes with Batman. They also had it with other superheroes and they had it with um, girl themed items as well. This one I picked up for my brother. He loves Batman. So I'm gonna be sending this in his direction. Um, and this is what the final piece looks like. I don't know if we can get the camera to focus, can we? Okay, well, more or less, you can kind of tell. Uh, but again, Batman, 48 pieces, so it's ages six and up, and um, so a name brand, of course, and again, they have other varieties. This one, I'm gonna be donating to that um, Aspire Behavioral Health Hospital, um, which I've discussed in previous videos. This is a 500 piece, and I think I bought this before, but I'm not sure. I just love it's um, the artwork on it. Um, this little town here, or whatever this is, it says it's Edward Quine Stables Riding Academy, Breeding and Boarding, Horse Lovers Paradise. So that's what this little, I know it's hard to focus. Let's see if we can get it to, um, nonetheless, a really cute puzzle. It's great to work together um, on these as a family. Um, great stocking stuffers again, and this is just so adorable. And this is going to be going into the donation box um, of that hospital. These are rub on transfers by Crafter Square, and you are getting it doesn't say wow, why doesn't it say? Well, it doesn't say, nonetheless, um, really pretty, kind of like a Victorian style. Um, so you got the teacups here with the saucers, um, these are letters, flowers, birds. And you just got that vintage Victorian style, uh, Victorian era um, stickers. I think these are really pretty. They're very romantic. 
and they make for great crafting here they're giving you some ideas as to how you can transfer them on and seeing reviews online from other youtubers these work very well okay and then i picked up from christmas house stickers these are metallic stickers and look how they shine well how they reflect this lighting so you got like snowman and santa claus and teddy bears and all different kind of stickers I know there's a lot of reflection guys, so I'm trying my best to show them to you. Um, in this set, you get 25. Um, also picked up these. These are super cute because they look like snow globes. Look how cute those are. Little snow globes. And you know, the penguin, um, look at him. He's inside that little jar there, mason jar. Just adorable. And they've got the, a lot of glitter, very glittery. And these are 15 pieces, again, Christmas house. Also picked up, um, what are these? $1 decorator, peel and stick decorations. I thought these were so beautiful for a little girl's room, a little girl's bathroom. And I just love the little, the mermaids that are on here. I love the styling of the art. And they're beautiful lashes. So th there's this one right here, the brunette one. And then you have this little um, war narwhal, narwhal shells a little cat mermaid and then here's the blonde she's got her cute little bun look how cute that is and then a what is this a sea star sand dollar this one's with the pink hair so this is the back and again a turtle here and then her with her beautiful black hair and look at this seahorse so um if i do an up close i doubt it'll show up guys no it's not going to show up but so cute great little gift for a girl's room and of course as aforementioned aforementioned girls like horses and unicorns and so i found this one look how pretty this is and it just looks so magical all the florals is beautiful unicorn um here's going to be the other side of it so you can see the mane and more flowers and this is an up close again i know guys the camera does not like focusing for whatever reason um but here we are look at that beautiful horse great and at a dollar what a great deal all right last items guys this is going to be stationary this video is getting long um so here i have some magnetic bookmarks and these are christian inspired so they're in the shape of crosses and they're um again magnetic bookmarks so this one says um it says be still faith versus faith over fear pray hard and they're just uh, doubles of each print so that's what these look like. Great for a friend that's, you know, um, you know, very involved with church, very involved with Bible study. Um, very um, great gift for someone that needs encouragement. Thought these were beautiful and they actually had it in multiple patterns. These are just the ones that I like. So these are the ones that I picked up. Okay. Other items that I picked up. Now, all of these are blank, but I thought they were so cute. And a two for a dollar for Hallmark. Hallmark name brand cards so these are greeting cards hey i haven't talked to you in a while hello um i'm wanting to say hello i, ha I need to reach out just dropping a little note and the cute little old-fashioned rotary phone and i just love the font the yellow and look at that reflection here and again blank on the inside and here's the envelope this one look new year's is around the corner and we are going to celebrate getting out of 2020 and looking forward to a new year to come beautiful metallic gold and the matte black again blank on the inside you can write whatever you want and yes hallmark is the brand of all of these cards this one is just so pretty look at these tropical birds the beautiful vibrant colors of this card um look at that parrot beautiful and then the cockatoo what is this a cockatoo no toucan that's a toucan a cockatoo here uh, again, blank on the inside, but this one is blue. And yes, Hallmark. This one came with a blue envelope. I think this would even look cute framed. You do a little matting, you get a beautiful frame, and you can put this on a bookshelf, um, on your end table, on your wall. This one is absolutely beautiful. Gold metallic. Valentine's Day is right around the corner, but you do not have to wait for Valentine's Day to reach out and let somebody know that you love them beautiful print look at that print guys how beautiful is this blank on the inside and you get a gold 
Hallmark envelope with this. This one, the, the chair is what sold me. The chair is so adorable. I could not pass it up. This one says, thinking of you on your birthday. Today is your birthday, a day to reflect on all the memories a lifetime has brought. Today is your birthday, a day to remember as somebody special with every warm thought. Check that out. Look at this chair, isn't it cute? And then you got this little design up here. The font is beautiful. The quote is beautiful. Again, Hallmark. And it's just the chair that did it for me. It's so adorable. And this one came with this pink envelope. So pretty. Okay, this one is Venezia. Venice. This is like a little piece of artwork. And you have like a watercolor photo. Watercolor photo of Venice. And you can see the gondolas. Oh my God, is this not beautiful? Look how beautiful this card is. Could you not see yourself like using this in some kind of a craft, mod podging it onto something, um, framing it and hanging it up, you know, maybe adding a matting, um, a larger frame. And now this very small card becomes a larger picture that you can then hang on the wall. I think it is so beautiful. Um, and who doesn't like the beauty of Venice? Um, and this one came with a lavender card and it just matches beautifully. L lavender envelope, guys, not a card. Again, Hallmark, it matches beautifully with this card. Okay, and then I bought this composition book. This is going to be donated to the um, Aspire Behavioral Hospital. I picked up several, several, several of these adult coloring books. Again, donating them to the hospital. This one's in a Christmas theme. And you get all these beautiful Christmas pictures to color. I've already donated a lot of colored pencils to them and crayons and markers. So these will be sent this way. This is a collection. So if you're looking for more, um, these are mandalas. Picked up this one as well. And here you got these beautiful prints to color in. So I picked up this one. This one is like my favorite just because of the artwork. Look at that, that tiger. And this is Creative Animals, and it's a dull coloring book. So it's all kind of animals to color in here. Again, this is going to be donated to that hospital. Another Christmas one. So what this one looks like. Great stocking stuffers, great gifts. Um, teens, young kids, adults who like coloring. Here's another one, Christmas related. And this one is Dress Me Up Mermaids Coloring and Activity Book. So this one... Um, so what it looks like, and I found these in the coloring book aisle. This one comes with stickers, which you can then place on the pages. So the pages have areas that are missing where the stickers would go. And let me show you the stickers. Where are they? Maybe they're in the back. Yeah, they're in the back or in the middle. Here they go. And they have this in Knights and Dragons as well as Unicorns. So I pick up the Mermaid one. Um, okay, so we're almost down to the end. Um, last things, I picked up these dual FX ink pens. So it says that the two colors in one, 3D effect, um, perfect for doodling, make 3D effects double tip. So it comes with two colors. There's two different kinds that I found. So these are the ones that I found. And I took the liberty of getting a notebook out and also opening up one of the packages to see what it does. So I'm going to write my name. And let's see, um, yeah, I'm not seeing the, the dual effect, but maybe that was me. Here, let, oh, it does. Okay, I see. It was, it was my fault. Okay, I see. Okay, so this is how it works, guys. So it's got two tips. And so I wrote my name twice here. And it writes in the two inks at the same time. I just wasn't holding it the right way. So this is really cute, and these are going to be very It comes in three individual sets, so it's one, two, and three. They are sold individually, and they are by the brand Voila. All right, guys, this brings this. Um, this could also be a little cake. If you wanted to make it look like a cake, you could. Um, this brings this Dollar Tree haul to a wrap. Um, I hope I was able to show you guys 
something that you are so excited to run out and be on the hunt for at your local Dollar Tree. Again, my name is China. Um, my channel is Zach Girl China. I hope if you like the video, you'll hit the thumbs up button. Um, please subscribe to my channel or consider subscribing, sharing the video with a friend or family member and hitting the notification bell button. Y'all have a wonderful day. I'll catch you guys at the Dollar Tree. Bye guys.